Welcome to lesson 46 in our HTML and CSS section in Free Code Camp. Today we're learning more about inheritance. This one is uh, titled Inherit Styles from the Body Element. So now we've proven every HTML body or every HTML page has a body element and that its body element can also be styled with CSS. Remember, you can style your body element just like any other HTML element, and all your other elements will inherit your body element style. First, create a H1 element with the text Hello World. Then, let's give all elements on your page the color of green by adding color green to your body element style declaration. Finally, give your body element the font family of monospace by adding font family monospace to your body element style declaration. So first we need to create an h1 element. We just want to make sure our h1 uh, element we create is not inside of our style tag. Our style tag is specifically for CSS. So we want to actually do that down here. So we have our opening and closing tag for our h1 and they want us to have hello world um, inside of it. So hello world period. So now we have hello world. In our heading one tag here, it's displayed. It tells us uh, make sure your H1 has the closing tag. We made sure. Give your body element the color property of green. So this is where we'll see inheritance um, take place. So our H1 uh, tag or H1 element is inside of our body, um, our content, uh, whatever H1, H2 paragraphs, whatever will be inside of our body. So Whatever style we specify to the body will be applied to everything inside of it as well. So if we were to give it a color of green, then all text within the body will be color green. So color green. So as you can see, the color green, which we asked to be done to body elements, actually uh, came also to the h1 element so h1 element inherited from the body um let's see what else it says give your body the color property of green give your body element the font family property of monospace so again same concept applies we would give it a font family of monospace and it should also apply to the h1 tag since it is inside of the body so monospace as you could see, now we have that different font. Uh, what else? Your H1 element should inherit font from font monospace from the body. Your H1 element should inherit the color green from the body. So that's it for this lesson. Let's just test it, make sure we're good. Cool.